The devotion for Monday, February 7th, is found in the Upper Room Discipline, written by Brandon Robertson. The scripture reading is Jeremiah 17, 5, and 6. Thus says the Lord, Cursed are those who trust in mere mortals and make flesh their strength, whose hearts turn away from the Lord. They shall be like a shrub in the desert and shall not see when relief comes. They shall live in the parched places of the wilderness in an uninhabited salt land. The word of God for the people of God. Thanks be to God. Faith often requires us to trust in a perspective other than our own, which is an incredibly hard thing to do. It often asks us to suspend our rational judgment for a moment and trust that our infinite creator has a much better grasp on our situation than our mere finite minds do. In today's passage, the prophet Jeremiah tells the people of Israel something that they've been reminded of again and again. When they rely on the human way of doing things rather than the way of God, they will find themselves dried up, parched, and dying. They will, the prophet says, miss out on the prosperity that God has promised to bring when they trust in the divine will. Too many of us have been conditioned to feel as if God's commands or the commands of anyone are to be kept, are to keep us from doing what we want to do. The truth is, however, that the principles and the lessons of Scripture are intended to guide us on the path of abundant life. They seek to provide a corrective to the finite and flawed human be belief that working hard enough, earning enough money, or experiencing the most pleasure will lead to a fulfilling life. Not only does this path not lead to fulfillment, it actually drains the life out of us. Jeremiah's message is clear. Don't trust in the limited perspective of humans, or you will be greatly disappointed. As we go about living day by day, it is important to ask if we are looking at our circumstances from a self-centered, limited, human lens, or if we are seeking to align with God's per perspective, even if it doesn't make immediate sense to us. Our answer to that question will determine the quality of life that we live. Let us pray. Oh God, help me not help us not to rely on our own perspective, but to have the faith and courage to trust that your ways are higher than ours. Amen. Be blessed this day.